Hello everyone and welcome to this video by IntelliPad. So today we're going to talk about PL300, a Microsoft certified Power BI exam. The PL300 exam is your ticket to becoming a Microsoft certified Power BI data analyst associate. So this Power BI certification is designed to provide analysts with the knowledge and skills needed to leverage and deploy Power BI at scale across organizations. Preparing for the PL300 Microsoft Power BI Data Analyst Associate Certification exam necessitates a consideration of time required, the cost involved, and professional development and job opportunities. The Microsoft PL300 may be the best certification for you if you enjoy data analysis and need to use Power BI to uncover data insights. This is especially true if you use your insights to create clear data visualizations that will assist your team and company in succeeding. Earning this Microsoft certification is a great way to advance one's career as a data analyst. But before we go further, let us take a look at the agenda of this video. First, what is Power BI? Then we talk about the common uses of Power BI. Then, key features of Power BI. Then we're going to talk about exam PL300. And then, the concepts you need to know. And the exam outline. And how to prepare for the PL300 exam. And with that, we'll conclude. But before we begin, please make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell icon so that you never miss any updates from us. So let us begin by understanding what is Power BI. Microsoft Power BI is a business intelligence platform that provides tools for aggregating, analyzing, visualizing and sharing data to non-technical business users. The user interface of Power BI is fairly intuitive for Excel users and its deep integration with other Microsoft products makes it a versatile self-service tool that requires little upfront training. What are the common uses of Power BI? Microsoft Power BI is used to discover patterns in an organization's data. Power BI can assist in connecting disparate data sets, transforming and cleaning the data into a data model, and creating charts or graphs to visualize the data. All of this information can be shared with other Power BI users in your organization. Power BI data models can be used in a variety of ways for organizations, including the following. First, telling stories with charts and data visualization. Investigating what-if scenarios within data. And developing reports that can answer questions in real time and aid in forecasting to ensure departments meet business metrics. Let us look at some of the key features of Power BI. Microsoft has and continues to add a number of data analytics features to Power BI since its inception. The following are some of the most important features. First, AI. Users can use Power BI to access image recognition and text analytics, build machine learning models with automated ML capabilities, and integrate with Azure machine learning. Then we have support for hybrid deployment. This feature includes connectors that allow Power BI tools to connect to a variety of data sources from Microsoft, Salesforce, and other vendors. Then, customization. This feature allows developers to customize the appearance of the platform's default visualization and reporting tools, as well as import new tools. APIs for integration. This feature provides sample code and application program interfaces for developers to use when embedding the Power BI dashboard in other software products. Last, view of the model. Users can divide complex data models into separate diagrams based on subject area, multi-select objects, and set common properties, view and modify properties in the properties pane, and set display folders for easier consumption of complex data models. So what is exam PL300? So this course was previously known as DA100 Analyze data with Microsoft Power BI training. Participants will learn how to create actionable insights by leveraging various data sets and then building data models using the Power BI tool during this Power BI Data Analyst certification training. The PL300 exam assesses your ability to identify business requirements, clean and transform data, build data models, deliver actionable insights, enable others to perform self-service analytics, and deploy Power BI solutions for consumption. The PL300 also assesses your knowledge of Power Query by having you write simple expressions in DAX and publish solutions to the Power BI service. This certification exam is for those who are business intelligence professionals, 
data analysts, IT managers, data scientists, or professionals managing data for decision making. Let us look at some of the concepts you need to know to crack PLC 100. The skills required are classified into four functional groups. First, prepare the data. Under this topic, there is get data from data sources, clean the data, and transform and load the data. Next, model the data. Under this, design and implement the data model, create model calculations by using DAX, and optimize model performance. The third topic is visualize and analyze the data. Under this topic, we have create reports, enhance reports for usability and storytelling, and identify patterns and trends. The last topic is deploy and maintain assets. Under this, manage data sets, create and manage workspaces and assets. Becoming proficient in these topics could be of great help for cracking the PLC under the exam and obtaining the Power BI Data Analyst Associate Certification. So let us look at the exam outline. The exam outline is as follows. The exam consists of 40 to 60 questions. The examination is scheduled to last 180 minutes. Questions include multiple choice, true or false, drag and drop, list building, and case study. Although Microsoft has formally not stated any prerequisites, the following knowledge would assist you in passing the exam. First, using Power Query and DAX to create expressions, understanding of data analysis and visualization topics, data concepts at their most basic, and knowledge of how to use relational and non-relational data in the cloud. Your Power BI Data Analyst Associate credential will be valid for a year after passing the PLC honor exam. To renew the certificate, the candidate must take a free online Microsoft Renewal Assessment six months before the expiration date. So how to prepare for the Microsoft Power BI Data Analyst Certification, that is the PL300 exam. First, concentrate on the key components of the exam. Microsoft provides adequate study materials for learning the concepts of the Microsoft Power BI PL300 certification exam. Visit the official Microsoft exam webpage and read the syllabus thoroughly. Make a copy of the syllabus topics and plan your study time accordingly. This will help you decide where to start and what to study. Then, understand the PL300 exam structure. Understanding the PL300 exam syllabus and key details such as exam duration, question type, and PL300 exam cost will help you. Second, understand the PL300 exam structure. Understanding the PL300 syllabus and key details such as exam duration, question type, and PL300 exam cost, among others, will help you get a step closer. We recommend that you read them thoroughly to get a sense of the exam's content to help you study more effectively. Third, create a study plan for the PL300 exam. The following routine will assist you in including all topics on time, revising them, and taking adequate rest in between. Giving your study time some structure is essential because if you don't, it will become far too easy to procrastinate and become distracted. Determine your research method. Self-study does not provide you with adequate study resources or the convenience of resolving your doubts whenever you want. So sign up for an e-learning platform where industry professionals share their knowledge and you'll have access to the best exam preparation resources. Furthermore, study materials from e-learning platforms can be accessed at any time from any location with the assistance of someone identifying and filling knowledge gaps available 24 hours a day, 7 days a week. If not, you can self-study and follow the Microsoft Power BI for beginner's tutorial to fully understand the tool. Then, PL300 practice exams. The practice tests are the last but most important. PL300 practice exams are essential for increasing your confidence while decreasing your anxiety. It also allows you to assess your abilities and knowledge. As a result, the practice tests are designed to expose you to the actual exam environment. After completing the practice test, you'll be able to easily identify your weaknesses and work on them. Then, experiment with the Power BI tool practically. Even if you're familiar with every detail and concept of Microsoft Power BI, you must understand how to apply these details in real-world situations. Microsoft has created, maintained, and is consistently improving a virtual lab. 
After completing your self-paced portion, you can use such labs for hands-on experience. Last, analyze your prep. Try out the Microsoft Exam Sandbox and evaluate your preparation. Take the actual exam once you're satisfied with your results. And with that, we have come to the end of this video. I hope you have a better understanding of the PL300 exam and moved a step closer to cracking it. Thank you for watching. Just a quick info guys. Intellipad provides Power BI online certification training in partnership with Microsoft. Mentored by industry experts. The course link is given in the description below. Now, let's continue with the session.